joining us for this Friday night edition of the NBA on 2K Sports. I'm Kevin Harlan, joined by Chris Weber and Greg Anthony. David Aldridge is our sideline reporter. We've got the visiting team and the home team. Now the starting group for the visitors. Here's Knox, defended by Butler. Here's Knox, banked in off the glass. And the first of many to come. Explosive offensive talent on both sides. Yeah, I I'm curious to see which team is able to dictate the pace tonight as well as the style of play. First one drops. And so Butler nails both of them. Well, his free throw shooting is something they never need to worry about. He doesn't even know how to go through a cold streak. Covered by Mitchell. Poked away. And he stepped in the line, so they turn it over. Here's Mitchell. Now here's Butler. Tries again. Rebounded by Knox. We play just over a minute here in the first. And the ball ends up out of bounds. And they'll keep possession. Yeah, gets a finger on it, but just can't quite come up with the steal. Uh, appreciate the effort, though, making his presence felt defensively. First quarter, just over a minute played. Covered by Mitchell. Six on the shot clock. That's tipped. In the corner, knocks with it. No good with the triple. And we're about a minute and a half into the first quarter. Three pointers off the mark. A little over a minute 30 into this first quarter. Covered by Elliott. Pass to Knox. Takes the three. He doesn't hit that one. Here in the first quarter, with about two minutes gone by, here's Butler. Oh, and the jam by Butler. And the home team has possession. Trailing by two. Sixteen feet away. Rebound by Mitchell. Right wing from deep. No good on that one. Just one for five from the field now. I mean, they've come out flat. They need to pick up the energy. Down low. And it ends up out of bounds. And they retain possession. And here in the first, approaching three minutes played. Nice work on the glass, but his defense was even better. Really has an impact on that shot. 
Elliott passes to Butler. Kicks it to Mitchell. That one's no good. 0 of 1 to begin the game. Now, here's Childress. D right on him. Four on the clock. Pass to Knox. From deep three-point range. Knocked loose. Yeah, good job. Just staying alert there, snatching up that long rebound. And it goes down two points. Butler's got six. <laughs> that's just great touch. The teardrop, oh, that's all about fear. Time out, time out. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain Started. some confidence. Yeah, things not going their way, and he wants to just try to talk this one over. Well, the defensive intensity has to pick up, and I'm sure Coach is going to let them know that. We're just over three and a half minutes into the first quarter. Hernandez. Yes, that goes in. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Yeah, very little resistance. I mean, you had to bring much faster help than that. Now here's Butler. He's got six. Here's Teague. And not going to go. He misses the first attempt on the night. to the inside. Nice pass. Nice catch and a resounding dunk. Yeah, outstanding job there of taking the harm and still able to finish. And that drops, so they now lead by one. There's 154 left to play here in the first. Butler goes in. The shot's good. Butler's got his third bucket of the night. And off to a strong start offensively. He's got a nice touch. 133 left here in the first quarter. Passes to Hernandez. Fires for three. No good on that one. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. Maggetti kicks to Butler. Takes the 13-footer. Missed it, shooting 50% at three for six. And 
they call the foul, so he's got the and one chance here to make it a three-point play. Yeah, another nice bucket down low. They've really been able to work the ball into the post effectively here so far. Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. And uh, 101 left here in the opening quarter. And there's the pass to Chan. Outside Butler. Shot clock at six. The jump hook. And it's wide right. It's off the rim. For a player who's almost a sure thing to score in tight, that was a stunt. Great D that time from T. The D hanging tough and stopping what would normally have been an easy lay. Here's Hernandez. It's good for his second make. He's made two or three so far. Well, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. They keep getting in the paint and continue to score consistently. Maggetti with it. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. No question. He got bumped on that shot. This is the free throw. And he sinks the second. Here's Hernandez. And the last shot at the buzzer doesn't go in for him. So at the end of one quarter of play, still a close game. The home team up three. Stay with us as we get set to bring you the second quarter right after this. And if you're just tuning in, it's been a pretty even game through the first quarter. Guys, what's your take on the home team so far? You got to credit their defense, communicating, rotating, making plays on the ball. No question. It's been stifling thus far, preventing that offense from establishing any kind of rhythm. And here's Maggetti. No points in the game yet for him. And a chance here presented by Gatorade to see who's on the floor. All fueled up and ready to go for the start of the second quarter. We've got Parker, and it's Teague in at the three spot. Yeah, yeah, and that's what I'm talking about. I mean, the D is worrying too much about the other four guys. I mean, they can't give him open jump. Defended by Butler. against Parker. Brown inside, covered by Parker. And it's Brown missing. Teague left side. Pass to Chan. Back to Teague. Lock at six. From downtown. 
Can't get it to go. He's taken two and missed two. Covered by Elliott. And he uses the glass on the layup. He has five. Now, I'm not sure who was supposed to be on him that possession. I mean, apparently, neither did the defenders. Maggetti outside. To the middle. Here's Chan. That's tipped. Hernandez. Covered by Maggetti. And a sharp pass to set up that high percentage shot in close. And here in the second, two minutes gone by. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions. Right now, they need the basket. Shot on the wing. They get it again. Chan goes to the reverse layup and drops it in. Really strong rebounding on the interior, and he gets the easy putback. Uh, timeout, adjustments timeout. are a part of the game, and the coach sees something he doesn't like here. Yeah, I, I like the chess match that's going on here. Each team trying to find and, and exploit the favorable matchup on the floor. Under two and a half minutes gone by here in the second quarter. Pass to Knox. Makes it off the glass. Knox has got his second bucket of the night. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Yes, the turnaround. And I like the decision making. He's taking what the defense is willing to give him. Oh, yeah. And that's just a good read on his part. And as usual, his mid range jumper is on point. Kicks to Childress. Here's Knox to the paint. Shot clock at three. That one good for two. Man, have they been effective at getting the ball inside. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Maggetti outside. Passes it to Elliott. The dish to Maggetti. Here is Elliott. This is the deep three-point attempt. Now Childress. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Inside. Bucket is good. They are attacking the rim and getting great results. A minute 50 left to play in the first half. Maggetti the pass to Mitchell. The rebound by Childress. 
Here's Knox, covered by Elliott. Oh, and that one, no question, powered it down. And this offense is in a perfect rhythm, and you can see how they're finishing their plays. Yeah, right now it feels like they can't miss. We'll see how long they can make this last. Now, here is Maggette. We've got 113 left in the first half of the game. And offensively, they've gotten stuck on the perimeter, falling in love with the jump. The pass to Knox. Covered by Maggette. Dishes it to Childress. Shot clock at five. Pass to Knox. And he hits it just before the shot clock expires. Knox has got six. Just playing with poise and confidence, and they continue to put points on the board. Yeah, Greg, they're just playing smart basketball. Reading the floor well and executing. Pass to Elliott. Mitchell with the bounce pass. To stop the drought. Rebounded by Knox. Two-second difference between shot clock and game clock. There's 18 seconds left to play here in the half. 11 seconds left in the first half of basketball. And there's the turnover. Pass going out of bounds. A flat-out loss of concentration. That kind of turnover will drive a coach crazy. Seven seconds left here in the second. Butler from outside. And the last second attempt doesn't fall. So we've reached the end of the first half of play. The home team, they lead by 11. And we'll be back right after halftime to get the third quarter underway. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, everybody. Good to see you back here on our halftime show. Well, actually, we can't see you, but you can see us, but you get it. Ernie Johnson, Kenny the Jet Smith, Shaquille O'Neal. You're watching the NBA on 2K Sports. Taking a look at this home squad. And, big fella, let's get your thoughts on the home team. Well, I like it, Ernie, because they're just not settling for outside shots. You know, that part of the game is pretty when it's going in. We've seen plenty of teams try that and fail. Got to have a balanced approach. And tonight, they found a ton of success inside. Basketball and championships are won inside out. Trust me, I know what I'm talking about. How about you, Kenny? What did you think about the visiting team? Well, my question is, who are their playmakers? We saw too much dribbling, too little ball movement, too few assists. Well, it's not rocket science. You don't have to have a degree in any kind of science. The best teams always have and always will be unselfish. And that does it for our halftime show. We now take you back to Kevin Harlan for the start of the third period. on the scoreboard the second half begins with very different goals for these teams one side trying to mount a comeback one side trying to protect their lead and foul on the shot so he'll get a chance at the line the right play defensively if you can't block force him to the line and this is his second trip to the line in the game take a break take a break two shots Free throw, good Butler. And 
And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Here's Knox. To the inside. Covered by Mitchell. Here's Knox. Defended by Butler. Six to shoot. From down in the low post. It goes. It's a great move, and he catches the defense completely off guard. You'd like to see a little more energy coming out of halftime with the defensive end. Oh, that's blocked. Here's Knox, covered by Elliott. About one minute played here in the second half. Passes it to Knox. Beyond the arc, rebounded by Elliott. Now here's Butler, defense right on him. Here is Elliott, nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. It's his first trip to the line. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And that one misses. Good on the second free throw. And we're just about a minute and a half into the third quarter of basketball. Covered by Mitchell. And the layup's good off the glass. Yeah, these defenders just look a bit overmatched, especially inside. Butler. He's covered closely. Here's Parker. It's blocked. Goes up again. And it's going to be out of, out of bounds. And they'll keep possession. Into the third we go. Two minutes in now. Five on the clock. Chan passes to Mitchell. From outside, off the mark. Ouch. Five shots without a make. That's a really ragged start coming out of halftime. Rebound by Butler. Butler's got his fourth rebound in this one. Here's Mitchell. And so out, out of bounds it goes. They'll keep possession. Parker left side. Outside Butler. Down to five on the shot clock. The pass to Chan. The shot's good on the assist by Butler. Five points in the game. Oh, no hesitation to get it to the rim. He uses his height advantage to convert the easy one. Pass to Hernandez. Misses in close. Now here's Butler. 
12 points for him. He's had four chances at the line, made them all. Take a break, take a break. Two shots. Free throw, good Butler. He's perfect from the line this time. Hernandez, covered by Mitchell. Here's Hernandez, and he throws it down hard with one hand. He's just rubbing it in their faces with that dunk. <laughs> he is never going to take his foot off the pedal. What a performer this guy is. He relishes the chance to hammer it down. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the third quarter. Butler deciding where to go with it. Score the basket, his fifth of the game. He's missed six shots against those five makes. And that's a perfect setup. Solid screen, defender can't avoid it. Opens up a clear path to the bucket. Passes it to Hernandez. <laughs> Defended by Butler. Some solid defense from Butler. On the wing, Mitchell. The shot's good on the assist by Butler. And you see the ability to rise and fire from mid-range, even against that length. Yeah, the defender just couldn't quite close the gap all the way and got burned for it. Takes it up with both hands and rips it down. The D just kind of stepping aside and letting him get to the rim. There's a reason, G.A., the lead is what it is right now. Oh, Kevin, the coaching staff has to be upset. You can't give the opposition easy buckets like this, G.A. Pass to Brown. Hernandez defended by Butler. 14 feet away. That shot missing. Now, look, even if he had other places to go with the ball, that's a good shot. You, you can't blame him for letting that one fly. To the middle. Here's Chan. No good on the shot. A bit long that time. Hernandez. Covered by Mitchell. Here's Hernandez. Another shot. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. And these are his second and third free throws tonight. First free throw is good. And good on the second, so he makes them both. 35 seconds left to play in the third. Elliott kicks to T. Tree 
23 seconds left in the third. The shot by Tinsley, no good. And he did everything he could to make that shot as difficult as possible. Excellent D. Avoiding fouling and, and gotten the perfect position to alter the shot. First one falls for. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. We've got 13 seconds left to play in the third. Here's Teague. A teardrop layup falls off target. With one on the clock. No good there. And so it's the home team looking at a 13-point lead heading into the next quarter. Defensively, they have gotten after it, contesting every shot going up. We'll return shortly. And let's take this chance now to show you the State Farm assist of the game. And he sliced the D wide open with this feed. They had no chance to prevent that basket. <laughs> no, it's quick decision making. You see a guy open, you can't hesitate. That, that, that's an outstanding play. And there may not be a lot of drama down the stretch as we head into the fourth quarter, but stranger things have happened. Covered by Mitchell. Got a piece of it. Lock at four. The pass to Knox. Fires the three. Great D that time from T. Knox has gone three for eight tonight from the field. They've got Elliott. And it's Mitchell in at the point guard position. Outside Teague. Lets it go with a three. And no good that time. No question who's been in control of this game. Boy, they have really taken charge here. Here's Knox. And it's blocked. Feeling it out a bit. Great touch on the 16-footer. A little over a minute of the fourth quarter gone right now. Covered by Mitchell. Pass to Knox. Launches a three. Rebounded by Elliott. And even without that three ball dropping for him, the defense should have done more on that last play. That should give him a nice little jolt. Ah, uh, yeah, it has to. They need a jolt, GA. Hey, guys, you think he was sending a message on that one? He doesn't like losing. Pass to Knox. Covered by Mitchell. Draws contact on the shot, and now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. And giving up some inches inside, but makes up for it with an aggressive style. Yeah, it's the attack mindset. I mean, that helped him prevail right there. Sometimes you just got to go with your gut.
game moves along. Two minutes gone here in the fourth. Right side, Butler. And it's blocked. Fast break, here they come. Stolen by Mitchell. Here's the break. And slam dunk by Butler. Ooh, that's a double whammy, guys. <laughs> that's right. A great defensive play. Then the impact stuff. Oh, yeah. Bang, bang. An impressive sequence that has them fired up. Plays it up off the glass. And, and when the score is as lopsided as it is, and you can see they smell blood in the water, Pop Man is going for the jugular. Now, here's Mitchell. Can't connect from 13 feet out. A good board there, Kevin, but overall they're getting slightly out rebound. Offensive rebound, and he jams it with authority. Nothing soft about the putback there. And, and why chance it, right? Take the dunk if you've got it. Yeah, guys, but where was the box out? No excuse letting him roll that freely on the glass. Here's Childress, the rim-rattling two-handed jam. Yeah, just solid work on the back end of that play. Yep, you're right. Finish hard with two hands on that stuff. Well, it's been an express lane to the rim. Coach can't be happy about that. Four rotations. I mean, slow help and just not enough toughness on the interior. They've got a lot to talk about. Final buzzer. Let's take a look at our Jordan player of the game. Yeah, and his percentage from the field tonight, just amazing. He hadn't just been gunning. He, he's been picking his spots. And, and you need that kind of patience and discipline to shoot as well as he had. Good on the shot. The inbound play works to perfection. you got to love to get those quick hitters. we played just over three and a half minutes now in the fourth quarter. Over three and a half minutes through the final quarter now. It's blocked. Butler on the way. Mitchell outside. Here is Elliott. Shot clock at six. Outside Butler. Let's the three fly. And he's good on the three ball. He's not focused on the D on most possessions, but you can forget about him altogether. And there's a minute 45 left to play here in the fourth to the paint. Rebound by Butler. Butler's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Mitchell wide open. The shot's good on the assist by Butler. Butler's got three assists tonight. And the D really on its heels on that possession. Didn't know what to do. Pass to Knox. A minute 20 left here in the fourth quarter. There's the three. The shot missing. Here is Elliott. Free throw line jump shot. Count that one. I'll tell you, they're right in this. We'll see if they can maintain momentum. Yo, it would be a shame to make all this progress and let them off the hook. We gotta keep the pressure on. Thank you. 
MLS updated from the sideline. Let's swing it over to David Aldridge. Thanks, Kevin. Well, the head coach of the home team had some words for the team during the break. His demeanor was not one of a coach whose team was well ahead. He said this is the time to turn up the heat, make one final push, and try to close out strong. See if they were listening, guys. Thank you, David. Here is Elliott. They get it back. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. I'll tell you what, he earned his money on that foul. Shooting two. He drops the first one, and that brings them within five. So he makes both from the line. And great work at the line there to chip away at the lead. A few more productive trips here, and things could really get interesting. Covered by Mitchell. We've got 33 seconds left in the fourth. Here's Knox out to the right wing. And no good. Time out, time the try out. spell continuing for him. Guys, your thoughts? Uh, trying to stay alive. They've got to work quickly. Uh, yeah. Uh -uh. Time is of the essence. Basket in the foul. It's got to be the game. Plan. Got a nice little run going here. Yeah, just making it look easy on the offensive end. Ball stolen. And they foul intentionally. They're going to have to do that now again and again. They're not in the penalty yet. Had to foul and on that occasion to stop the clock. That's the enemy in this situation.
We've got 13 seconds left in the game. And that's an intentional foul. First free throw is good, and that puts them up by five. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a six-point ball game. Clutch, clutch free throws there. That should ensure they're going home with the W. Elliott passes to Mitchell. Let's it go from deep. That one doesn't go. So the home crowd treated to a win. Probably a little closer than they would have liked it, but a win nonetheless. Yeah, but I really got a sense that the fans gave them that emotional boost that was needed down the stretch. This crowd, man, they were electric. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For David Aldridge, Craig Anthony, and Chris Weber, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching the NBA on 2K Sports. We'll see you next time.